Welcome back. We're here with Amy Mills of 17th Street Barbecue out of Murfreesboro, and you guys have a really big event that is happening right now. I think it started yesterday, right? The Praise the Lard event. What is this all about? This is a wonderful event that brings so many people to Murfreesboro. This is a barbecue cook-off started by my dad and a group of his friends 36 years ago. Wow. And it has grown and it just burgeoned into the most fabulous barbecue event. We have welcomed 90 teams from 15 states to Murfreesboro. We are a tri-sanctioned cook-off. Mm -hmm. So we have Memphis Barbecue Network, Kansas City Barbecue Society, and Steak Cook-Off Association cookers, and some cooking multiple yeah. things within those sanctioning bodies. Mm -hmm. And we are giving away $30,000 in prizes along with wonderful works of art trophies. Mm -hmm. But most importantly, we are building community. Yeah. The people in the region come out to see us, to mm -hmm. see the cookers, to welcome them to town. And we are just so excited to welcome these people and show them gracious Southern Illinois hospitality. Oh yeah, I mean, it sounds like a great event and I'm sure the moment you step into Murfreesboro, you can just smell the goodness of this event. And so for people coming out to this event, what can people get ready to experience? Because obviously all of these people, the ones that are competing are doing all the cooking. So can I, if I were to go, can I try what they're making? How does that work? Well, unfortunately, no, because okay. they are cooking to win. They yes. are very focused on taking home those prizes. Mm -hmm. But we have 17th Street Barbecue. Yeah. We have a wonderful evening meal tonight mm -hmm. called the Grand Champion B Meal, uh, followed by music. Mm -hmm. We'll have two different bands. We'll be giving away steak um, contest prizes this evening. But the most fun part, I think, is wandering through yeah. the cook-off grounds, meeting people. Teams are very interested in talking mm -hmm. um, and meeting local people answering questions. It's just a really great time. Yeah, and I could imagine that a lot of people going probably get some good tips from these amazing barbecuers. Absolutely. Barbecue, the barbecue world and barbecue community mm -hmm. is so warm and welcoming. Yeah. They will tell you almost anything except for maybe their secret sauce <laughs> right. or dry rub recipe. <laughs> right, right. And so then you said that this is the 36th annual event of this 36 years in the making did you i guess ever experience ex expect this to be going on for 36 years well i wasn't even part of it in yeah, the very beginning yeah. so i have come along in much later years uh -huh. but i think the reason it's still going is because it evolves and changes yeah. we add more contests we add more fun mm -hmm. um, and it really has become a fixture oh, yeah. in our town. People are expecting the Apple Festival followed by the barbecue. Mm -hmm. That is amazing. And so how can people go about uh, going to this event? What does that look like? Do you just show up? Do you need to get a ticket? What's that Exactly. Like? You just show up. Okay. The evening meal has tickets at the door. Mm -hmm. It's $29 a person. It's a giant long buffet of different oh. foods and barbecue as well as lots of um, draft beer and other oh. beverages. And then the outside is really free. You uh -huh. can just show up and walk around. You do have to park on the perimeter mm -hmm. because there are lots of streets blocked off. Oh, we're, yeah. we're encompassing a four block area, wow. um, but there's plenty of parking. Mm -hmm. But really you just show up and walk around. That's there, awesome. You'll, you'll see the stage. It's all very visible. Yeah. And so then this is taking place tonight. Does it go on tomorrow as well? So tomorrow is really competition day. Mm -hmm. So people have their heads down and oh, they're yeah. working very hard. So tomorrow is fun to walk around, mm -hmm. but there's not going to be a lot of visiting with teams tomorrow okay. until they have turned in all of their competition yeah. entries. But I guess it's still, you guys are still allowing people to walk around and see how oh, they're absolutely. making the things and just to smell all the, the yummy meats that's being cooked up. Absolutely. That's awesome. And what time does things kick off tomorrow? Tomorrow morning turn-ins start at 9.15 mm -hmm. and they go until about 4.30. Okay. Awards are at 6 o'clock and really after that it's over. Yeah. So the big night is tonight. Okay. The meal starts at 5.30. It mm -hmm. runs from 5.30 to 8 and it's just a continuous thing mm -hmm. and then the bands start at six o'clock. Wow well tonight would be the night to get out Tonight's to Murfreesboro. The night. That is awesome. Amy thank you so much for joining us to talk a little about, bit about the Praise the Lard event. It sounds like it's going to be another wonderful time for you all. I wish you guys so much success out of that. If you guys need something to do this weekend this sounds like an amazing event to go and be a part of. Again thank you and we'll be right back. Thank you so much.